The government is working to ensure that the current water shortage does not impact production of semiconductors. The pledge came from Economics Minister Wang Meihua. Taiwan is home to TSMC, the world's largest semiconductor chip foundry. In 2019, TSMC used over 150,000 metric tons of water a day for its production. Wang says Taiwanese industry should have enough water to last through May. The organization Air Clean Taiwan has published its annual report on air pollution, and things are not looking good for the southern city of Gaoxiong. The report found that two of the city's districts have Taiwan's highest concentration of PM10. That's particulate matter smaller than 10 micrometers across. The group says that the gap in air quality between northern Taiwan and southern areas like Gaoxiong is continuing to grow. A store in Taipei is offering people with dementia the chance to become honorary manager for a day. Just one day each week helping out at the store is enough to slow down the advance of dementia. There are many people who could benefit from this program. Health ministry statistics show that 8% of people above the age of 65 in Taiwan suffer from dementia. That's at least 300,000 people. The sea goddess Mazu is used to traveling in style. Each year, her devotees carry her statues all across Taiwan in a series of religious parades. But she's never traveled quite like this before. A travel agency and an airline are teaming up to bring the goddess into the sky in a series of flights that will circle Taiwan and its outlying islands. Passengers will pray for Taiwan's well-being and an end to COVID-19.